the headline is that we found that digitalization of services during the pandemic has really widened the inequities that were already there for migrant patients in accessing primary care. The migrant patients were actually a bit more concerned about the physical closure of the surgeries and the fact that it was harder for them in some circumstances, some practices to get support from receptionists in doing forms or signposting to other services. We certainly asked our participants what their ideas were about how, how things could be improved. And they mentioned some really great ideas around use of YouTube for um, targeted healthcare advice, um, translated text in the patient's own language, for example, inviting for screening or things like that. Um, and also the idea of virtual group online consultations using an interpreter. But I think as well as um, engaging with the migrants themselves, there are some great resources out there. Um, examples from Doctors of the World, their Safe Surgeries Initiative. I think, you know, I'd love to see that really widely implemented. It's a, a programme where surgeries can sign up and say, we're going to try to remove those barriers to access for migrants. Even simple things like needing to show ID when you're registering. Um, and they've even got a toolkit specifically around the pandemic and how we can support migrant patients in that setting. So I certainly really encourage that for practices.